Hello everybody and welcome to another MX Bikes video and today guys we are gonna be grinding some Papiti. Alright it is currently almost 4am for me at the moment so I kind of need to be a little bit quiet. I'm not gonna be as expressive in this video. Hopefully I'm not yelling because I do have a roommate but yeah we're going to be riding the Papiti servers and uh, I'll talk to you guys a little bit about why I'm filming a video so late. Um, and also some more news in the Papiti uh, in the Papiti verse. Okay, so hit that someone hit that like button. Uh, race should be starting anytime now. But as far as why I'm up so late, uh, I did a live stream on Twitch. If you don't know, um, Twitch my Twitch is linked in the description. I go live maybe once a week, maybe twice. Um, just usually just get on Papiti, grind, play with play with viewers. Um, yeah, chat's usually super active, so. Be on the lookout. It's usually a later night stream. Um, again, I'm just chilling. It's nothing crazy. Um, it's a bit pixelated, but you know what? It's it's a chill time. But yeah, so I was streaming for about four and a half hours, and um, right off the bat, Skills joins my Papiti race. I'm like, okay, it's probably not him. Well, it was him, and I think he raced with me for about two hours straight. Um, beat me in every race. I didn't beat him a single time because, well, it's Skills. <laughs> probably the fast rider in the game um so didn't get much mmr my goal for tonight was to grind mmr didn't get much of it and then he left and then i started riding terribly and then Rax decided to join for the cherry on top and yeah i don't know i ended up gaining like 300 mmr maybe 200 in like five hours basically so pretty terrible night as far as ranked goes i didn't accomplish any of my goals but um you might be wondering troy why are you doing this dude why are you riding these stock tracks blah, 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 blah. well i'm number one rank right and there's been a familiar face that we all know and love that uh that's been grinding the PPD servers um and when i say grinding i mean he's who he's thrusting he's thrusting them servers dude um and that is that is the man. I mean, do I even need to say his name? It's Linz, dude. The the goat. Um, Linz been trying to catch me, bro. I don't know if you guys watch his recent video where he literally is almost like on a 200 race win streak. Um, there's an asterisk by it, though. And we're going to get into that right now. You might be wondering why. Troy, why did you not get taken out in that first corner? Well, we're on a non-contact server, dude. Now... Non-contact servers have been a thing since the beginning, right? So when you get blacklisted because of your safety rating, it goes under 950, you can come here and spend some laps, and that SR will inevitably go up. Does it help you learn to be a safer rider? No. It just makes the number go up. So honestly, I question the reasoning behind SR having to do with this server. I do understand it, though, because I do think, you know, when people are being idiots and running into other players all the time. They should be punished, but uh, I don't know. It doesn't really help. You know what I mean? I feel like there should be a contact server that you get sent to specifically for what just happened to me. Okay, I actually want to win this race. This is a Papiti server, by the way. I I need MMR, bro. I don't, I've don't. i just been riding terrible all night. But um, anyway, yeah, I don't know if it really helps people learn. I think there should be a contact server that those people need to go to. But uh, enough of that. Anyway, we're talking about non-contact servers, right? So he gained, what, like 8,000 MMR, 9,000 in the last, like, week or so, which is insane. Um, I mean, obviously, he's winning every single race because he's the freaking GOAT and he's fast as hell, but um, he did it on non-contact servers. Now, in my case, I have almost 16,000. I'd probably say maybe a thousand of that is from non-contact servers um and most of that's from just the last couple days and then i think one point there was a no contact forest server that i probably grinded for a night or whatever but for the most part you know over 90 percent of the mmr i've gotten has all been from contact servers now honestly it never even occurred to me that i could just sit in a non-contact and just win basically every race i mean it's it's pretty easy I mean, you're seeing it right here. As far as raw speed on these tracks, I'm decent. All right, compared to the average player base, obviously with these being, you know, just the casual or the beginner player, 
or the person that's obviously blacklisted, it's not too hard to win. So, honestly, Lens is a genius, dude. I I never thought about that. It's been three months, and I even think about it. So, pretty freaking smart. But anyway, he's catching up, and I don't want to make it easy on him, dude. I ain't making it easy on him, dude. No one's getting the pass, all right? If I have to stay up till 4 a.m. every night and play in these things, I guess it's what we got to do, dude. I'm the stock track demon. Everyone knows it. If there was a series on stock tracks, I think I'd do pretty decent. But, uh, I don't know, dude. At the end of the day, I love playing MX Bikes. And I really do think these servers can help grow the game, can help grow the competitive community as much as a lot of people would probably disagree with that opinion i think it's good to get people racing dude it doesn't matter what track it is um get people having fun on the game dude and i know it's stock and i know a lot of the more experienced guys are like dude come on get on the pro tracks but hey listen bro this game it's very hard to get into this game like if you really think about it from a casual player's perspective who's maybe playing four or five hours a week on this thing like bro they're not gonna hop on by a track and then find that one server with it on there like they're just gonna hop into here they don't have to worry about anyone starting it it's a quick race and they're gonna have fun and then they're gonna get off and do what they need to do so i think some of the pro guys some of the faster guys are the people that play this game a lot they're a little bit out of touch to that fact they don't really understand it but it's the truth dude you know 80 percent of the people play this game i guarantee you they don't really care about the pro stuff. Like, I just, they just don't, you know? They don't have the time of day to, to look into that. Or, again, this is a very niche game. It's a very niche crowd. It's a niche community, you know? So most of these people, they just hop on, run some races, and get off, dude. They won't get back onto the game till next week. So that's how I see it. I mean, maybe I'm wrong. I don't really think so. I mean, that's based off of the hundreds of comments I get and... You know, just the people I've talked to, the Discord messages I've received. There's a lot of new players, guys. Like, a lot. A ton. Which is awesome to see. And uh, I think that's what these servers excel at, is giving the new player a place to go. Alright? And unfortunately, they gotta see me walk around here every now and then. And be an absolute menace to society. But, hey. I have fun doing it. I wish P was a bit more competitive. You know? I mean, I just went through it tonight racing literally like the fastest player in the game so um it was fun it was definitely fun i pr'd on some tracks got a little bit quicker but uh yeah i don't know i don't even know what to talk about right now maybe about this race Let's see what lap time we run right now but yeah go follow the twitch man twitch in the description again i don't stream like a ton but i ran a 59 it's pretty bad I don't know. I just hop on weekends. I mean, it's a Thursday night I'm on, but I don't have school tomorrow, so we're, we're grinding, you know what I'm saying? I like streaming, dude. Streaming's, streaming's fun. Uh, my PC's not quite there. I actually had to end stream because my PC crashed. Hopefully it doesn't crash mid-race. Um, it's pretty warm. The thing is, uh, it's heating up to say the least, so in a couple weeks when it's freaking getting up to the 80s, uh, <laughs> I don't know, dude. I don't know how these videos are going to go. You're probably going to be hearing my PC scream. But uh, upgrade coming soon, guys. I'm, I'm thinking when I go home early May, it's like the first priority I have is to upgrade my computer and uh, start streaming more, dude. That's something I really want to do. I seriously enjoy streaming a lot. Um, just talking to people, bro. Talking to you guys. I know it's through a chat, but still. It's fun. It's more interactive than a YouTube video, right? We got, we got two more laps left here. Nice. Oh. Um, also, I can't wait to race MXGP, bro. I've been itching to do it. I just, again, when NA's on, when the regular series is on, I got class going on, so I haven't been able to race in that yet. I did do a preseason race for NA, which I qualified for. And I'm pretty sure I did, I think I did pretty well. I think I got like 17th overall or something like that. I don't know, that was a long time ago. I've gotten a lot quicker since then. 
But, uh, dude, outdoors is gonna be interesting this year, dude. It's... It's gonna be interesting. Um, aerial outdoors. Real life outdoors is gonna be interesting. It's... We're in for a fun summer, dude. That is for sure. Ah, oh, this is what I wish my night was like right here. Just coasting. But no, I got skills in the lobby. I'm pretty sure Panda was in a lobby. I don't know if it was actually him or an impo imposter. Rax joined. Larson. Like, a bunch of these fast dudes. Oh, man. It was a tough night. It was a tough night for the Trojan. The number one overall pl ranked player. He's a, He doesn't win. He doesn't win all the time, guys. Actually, I think if we calculate a percentage, it'd be basically not at all. Because freaking Skillium, dude. Why? How is Skill so fast, bro? Skills gave me a setup. All right. And I was like, I'm about to be, I'm about to become Jesus right now, dude. Um, the dude runs about two gallons of gas in his tank, which automatically was like, bro, there's no way you're being dead ass right now, right? There's no way. Um, anyway, it runs like a 110 on the back tire. It's just like the weirdest setup ever. And I ran it, and it was just terrible. I, I don't, I don't understand that, man. He's a different breed of a human. He's not like us, bro. Like, he's actually a robot. But, uh... Nah, it was fun racing him. It was fun getting second. Eating some roost for a change. Definitely humbling experience when he's like three seconds a lap faster than me. It hurts you. But uh, we're about to finish this race up here. Pretty, actually, it was a fairly long video. I mean, not long, but longer than I thought. It's already been 12 minutes. What the heck? What have I even talked about for 12 minutes? Oh yeah, this is about Papiti. I kind of forgot about that. Anyway, yeah, I'm not letting Linz take it from me. All right, we're fighting to the death. I don't care if I have to run another 8,000 laps on stock tracks. He's not beating me. All right, I put too many hours into this, dude. And also, I have a decent lead, so I gotta take advantage of it. But respect to Lens for grinding, all right, and respect to Lens in general. I mean, the dude's grinding just like me, uploading every single day, and he's been doing this for like what two years now? Over two years? I don't even know, dude. He's he did truly pave the way, I think, for this type of content, the content I make, especially the content I was originally making. Um, with just riding different tracks, doing track reviews and stuff. I haven't really done that too much recently. I mean, that can be, you know, connected to the fact that a lot of tracks have released. But anyway, dude, he's he kind of started this whole thing. So, I mean, it's it's always W. It's always a W lens in the chat, dude. It's always a W lens. But, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. And, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.